Hey, Google admins, welcome back to the Google Frontline Worker SKU training series or video series. Uh, I've created a few videos. Uh, you may, if you get a chance, please do watch them. Uh, they will help you understand the overview and features and security inside Google Frontline Worker SKU. In this video, let's talk about the pricing of Google uh, Frontline Worker SKU. How much would it cost you? Now, it's a per user per month pricing. Unfortunately, or you know, uh, Google does not publish the pricing online for this. So I won't be able to comment on how much would it cost, but rest assured that it's gonna save you a lot of money. It will be very cost efficient because you are not uh, using all the you know premium functionalities that you may in uh, high tier licenses like Google Enterprise Plus, okay? And because these field workers or frontline workers will be more towards consuming content than creating content, so Google will be charging less than what uh, it, it does for the regular Google Workspace licenses. Okay, so to check the pricing, you will need to uh, reach out to either Google sales reps or the Google partners, okay? Now, you uh, you can have partial uh, domain licensing, no PDL or partial domain licensing restrictions here, which means you can have any number of uh, a license match um, in, in your account or in your Google Workspace account. For example, you can have 800 or 700, let's say Google Enterprise Plus licenses and rest 300, maybe, uh, you know, Google Frontline Worker licenses. Now, there are some add-ons which are available on top of Google Workspace. And these add-ons are, first one is Google Vault. Because by default, Google Vault is not included in Frontline Worker License SKU. So you're, you won't be able to uh, retain uh, data for those users for e-discovery and archiving purposes. If you need that functionality, you should be able to purchase Google Vault as a standalone product, and then you can assign that Vault license to these frontline workers right from your admin console. You can also uh, get Cloud Identity Premium uh, to get functionalities like data loss prevention uh, on uh, on frontline workers that will cost you six dollars per user per month of course that's a public price and then uh, you can also get app sheet uh, which is a, like a no code low code uh, application builder from google it has a bunch of different variations so you you can check which uh, app sheet edition uh, you need for these users but yes you can certainly get it as an add-on to these uh, frontline workers. Now let's talk about the purchasing option in case if you're ready to uh, purchase Google Frontline Worker licenses. It's not uh, available uh, online somewhere yet. You should be able to purchase them either directly, uh, reaching out to Google and you know checking with your sale, Google sales rep, or you can reach out to Google partners whom you work with and they should be able to help you purchase frontline worker licenses. With that, I hope that might have been helpful a bit. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, do not hesitate to put that under this video. And in the next videos, I'll show you how you can manage licenses or license assignment, updation, and removal, either one by one or in bulk leveraging Google Apps Script. Till then, take care. Have a nice day.